I just saw Making It. I love it. It's like a, a, a craft show, but it's yeah. like um, Project Runway, but it's like, uh, I, it's very positive, too. Yeah, Nick Offerman and I host it, and it's, it's a competition show that's celebrating the process of making things, so it's all these... Um, makers who come on and have different strengths and we challenge them to make things in real time. Uh, it's good to see you and Nick back together for Parks and Rec. It's like, oh, perfect. Yeah. And, yeah. It's, okay. It just feels right. You're so funny and you're perfect together. You have great chemistry, but also I love that it's very you because you're like, yeah, I don't want to be the judge. I'm just the host of this thing. Yeah, I didn't want anyone to ever go home. So halfway, because <laughs> everyone's so talented, that halfway through we were kind of doing a bit, but we were seeing if maybe we could add some people. <laughs> like and, as the show goes on, it just more and more super, people start coming I on. About, I don't know about you guys, but I can't. As I, the, the world is so on fire right now that yeah. I want to I don't want anyone to be humiliated on TV or or I don't want anyone to feel <laughs> sad so I when you have these kind of shows you have to let you know, some someone has to leave yeah you know you gotta whole... free up the hotel rooms or whatever <laughs> yeah, yeah. So someone has someone's to gotta win. go yeah. and so it was we were really grateful that we weren't in that process we just kept kind of coming in and being like good luck guys I don't I don't know who's gonna get kicked yeah. off but <laughs> But, it, but then, it's, yeah. And then there's a fun little twist at the end that just made me laugh. And then you guys mm -hmm. got together. You did, like, interstitials throughout the show. You and Nick just talking about uh, what's happening with the show or what's going on. And you do this, these funny bits. But one was you did a pun off, which... Yeah, it's the lowest form of comedy. <laughs> I, it made it's me my, laugh. So yeah, it's like, my Hello, yeah, it's yeah. in my wheelhouse. It's yeah, like, lowest form of comedy? I'm mean, there. <laughs> That's all. I'm all I'll about that. I'll meet you at the bottom. <laughs> I'll meet you at the bottom, bro. It was so you just look at each other sitting across in, in like little folding chairs or something and have a pun off. And I just wrote something down because you're like, uh, y'all ready for this? Y'all ready of them. for yeah. this? Uh, I'm getting. Oh, did you hear a groan? That's perfect. <laughs> yeah, yeah. Someone just went. Oh, oh yeah. That's like, what a pun works when someone goes. Ugh. Oh boy, yeah. That's it. It was. Uh, it just went and you went rapid fire. I had a little <laughs> pun off. It's just a little part of the show, but it just made me laugh. I enjoy puns uh, as well. I love that. I also. Um, I like that you admit to not being crafty. No. <laughs> You're like, no. dude, that's not my thing. No, it was really cool because the people were really talented. And we walked around and saw what they were doing, but I can't do any of it. And and. Um, and I was truly learning, but I have the same skill as my children about, when it comes to making things, which is great, because we all make things together. But I kind of represented the person that doesn't make a lot of things. And Nick is an incredible oh, woodworker. and He's a crafty dude. He makes like, a, tables. and Yeah. And he's, look, he's also an actor and, you know, a lot of, no offense, Jimmy, but... <laughs> A lot of men in this business aren't kind of the guys you would run to when things go wrong, necessarily. <laughs> they what? don't... Like, maybe musicians, but not, like, actors are... <laughs> no offense. No, no, none taken, of course. But... The more you keep saying no offense, <laughs> the less offense I take. But you know, like, when you wear makeup for a living, and then... <laughs> you're not, like, Nick can Barely build wear a... Makeup. Nick can build a boat. I oh, know he can. So when, it, when the when the stuff goes down, I I'm can, running to him because he's gonna. Yeah, I know. I can barely I can barely ride in a boat. Let's be honest. Can I'm you, lucky can if I can drive, stand can up. Can you drive stick? No. Oh my god. Out of your mind? I drive stick. What, what are you talking about? Are you out of your mind? Can you change a tire? Can you change a tire? No, I have my driver do all that stuff. I don't even, even bother with driving stick. I watch that. I go, you're working too hard. You go, hey, hey get out there. <laughs> Uh, I want to show everybody a clip from your show. Uh, here's Amy Poehler and Nick Offerman on Making It. Take a look at this. <laughs> do you think woodworkers in general, do you guys like talking about yourselves? Uh, not so much. <laughs> I enjoy talking to other woodworkers. There's like Would a language. Like to leave? Leave? <laughs> yeah, right? <laughs> but what I'm noticing about you already, Cam, is you do a lot. Are you going to get it finished? I'm, I'm feeling pretty good about it. Okay, good. Um, yeah. Okay, here's my impression of everybody when you ask them about time. Ask me about time. So how, do, how are you feeling about your time management? Totally fine. Uh, I'm making a gigantic um, Ferris wheel, and I haven't started on any of it. There's 10 minutes left. Well, that's more than enough time. Okay, but now we're down to 9 minutes and 40 seconds. Cool with me. I, I don't even care. Yeah. Amy Poehler, everybody, making it. Premieres Tuesday, July 31st at 10 p.m. on NBC. On and on and on, uh, I said, and it's on and on and on.